dope. As I was heading out in Boosford, Brooklyn, I took the subway train, but then I know I gotta go back to Manhattan, and I decided to walk it all the way from Bushwick to Williamsburg. So I was gonna, like I said, I was gonna take the train, but I decided to walk because I think it's a good way to explore the neighborhood. So one funny thing from, from about walking around Bushwick to Williamsburg is that you can see a lot of contrast, you know, for some streets are a little bit more sketchier to nice streets like this one. Are, that are peaceful and quiet and you can see like you know little by little the gentrification going on and the way how they try to develop out the neighborhood so it's pretty cool you know and Williamsburg I've only been here like two times and it's a nice spot to explore so you know just gotta explore everything that we afraid to you know go to a place that you've never been and I gotta say today is a beautiful day and walking around the streets makes you feel like you're somewhere else, you know, like it's peaceful and quiet. I hear like the birds going on and I say something strange. It's only like 10 minutes away from Manhattan, so you can get the different contrast from one part of the city to another one. So it looks like in between all this concrete jungle, they have like a little farm over here. I'm not sure what they're planting, but it's pretty interesting, you know, the nature here bits up with the buildings. It's pretty cool. So a lot of people ask, you know, how are the best ways to explore New York City? Of course, by train, taxi, uh, boats, and many things, but I think the best way to explore is by walking like I'm doing right now. When you walk, you can see street by street, block by block, and you can get the feel of the neighborhood, you know, you can feel the vibe, the atmosphere of the neighborhood. Right now, I'm walking one of the main streets in Williamsburg, which is Bedford. It's full of restaurants, bars, coffee shops. It's pretty much a mix of everything, and you feel like a good vibe. One thing cool about Williamsburg is that they have a lot of cool buildings like luxury apartments like this. But at the same time they're pretty expensive but it's like you see a mixture of old buildings with brand new buildings. And if you go to the waterfront they're building like some tall skyscrapers so that's pretty cool. And I might be going there to catch the ferry to go to Manhattan because the weather's pretty perfect so I feel like it's a perfect time for me to take the ferry. Also walking around Williamsburg brings me memories because I came here with my best friends because I see my blouse, you see that we went to Canada together. So I came with my best friend Justin and his wife Brooke. So it was pretty cool. We walk around here, we had a nice meal and stuff. So yeah, like, looking at neighborhoods like this kind of reminds me of him. <laughs> like, I'm separate, you know, friends forever. I gotta tell you, it's a huge contrast from this neighborhood to the other neighborhood that I was before. Like, you can see a huge difference, but that's the beauty, the beauty about walking around neighborhoods especially in New York City you can see the difference from ethnicity to you know a variety of stuff from old buildings to new buildings so a little bit of everything so it's good that you explore the city walking around so I gotta say this tall building behind me it's kind of a strange looking building it's like the contrast from all these buildings here though not too tall but this building is like really tall and they're building it right by the waterfront so it's pretty interesting you know the, the development that's going on around here part over here reminds me of Bushwick. We saw the debate when I was in Bushwick throwing the murals and stuff. Like you can see the murals. But the difference over there, here's like more rich there, so they got like a lot of nice buildings. Over there in that part, there was a lot of warehouses, but then like the residential area, you know, it was a little bit different from here, but little by little, it's gonna be like another part of Williamsburg, so pretty cool. Just as I'm walking around the neighborhood and seeing the tall building, I discovered this thing behind me. I'm not sure if it's like a new park that they opened. I've never been in this part of the neighborhood, but I'm gonna go explore it. That's the beauty of walking around the streets that you see stuff that you never seen and you explore it and you have a great time. So now, excuse me, I'm gonna go enjoy this part over here with the view of Manhattan. The way that this part that I'm exploring is called the Domino Park. Pretty new, I'm not sure when did they open, but I know it's like a new spot, so yeah, it's pretty cool. So, so 
far this park is pretty nice, you know, I got like a lot of stuff to do. Like, but it's pretty much, you know, better for people to relax and sit here. Like me, I'm sitting around here enjoying the sunset. And they got like this water thing in my front. The bridge. Then uh, Manhattan skyline over there. So it's like a pretty cool spot to hang out around the summertime. So yeah, so far I've been enjoying this day pretty much. After I was working like a double shift of work, uh, I took a nap and I decided to treat myself for a nice meal and walk around. Like, I wasn't going to vlog today, but then I'm glad that I did because I get to explore all this nice stuff here in New York City and enjoy the nice weather. That's a little bit of the Domino's Park and it's pretty cool but now I'm gonna head to the other side because I'm in the mood for taking the ferry to Manhattan because I know it's a fun experience especially when the weather's nice so join me. So I'm here to buy the tickets for the ferry. If you want to buy it just press D like it says here. Then it choose you how do you want it one way so I'm just going one way. Then you want to pay so you just press pay. And then you just enter your car right here. I got the ticket right here. So let me see what time is the ferry coming. So I got about 15, 14 minutes left for the ferry to come. So I'm just gonna sit here, chill for a little bit and enjoy the sunset while the ferry comes. So here comes the ferry. So I'm gonna make sure I catch it so I don't miss it. So. Time to enjoy a little bit of ride to downtown Manhattan. Brooklyn, I walk around the neighborhoods, I took the ferry, I capture a nice sunset. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. So if you do, stay tuned for more, click the like, feel free to share the video, drop a comment down below if you like it, and stay tuned for more, and peace.